this one PC setting can save you hundreds of dollars eventually. So now you're thinking how the FS setting save you hundreds of dollars. Let me explain. Imagine you're gaming above 100 FPS and you see your CPU is using 50 to 60 watt and temperature is below 50 degree. But what if you play the same game at same FPS but your CPU is using nearly double the watts and nearly 30 degree higher for no substantial gain in performance. Not just in this game, I will show a different game which consumes CPU power for no gains. In Uncharted 4, we get power usage of 60 watt and temperature 47 degree after playing our PC setting. Without applying it, we see the same FPS but the CPU power usage is nearly double that we see before and temperature increased more than 12 degree. Same thing for a play XL Requiem from 52 watts to 82 watts with similar increase in temperature. The only noticeable performance gain is on CPU bound game like Valorant. With this specific settings, it handles nearly 400 FPS at 60 watts and 46 degree but see this increase in fps around 100 plus fps gained without this setting but the power usage is almost more than double and temperature increased nearly 30 degrees more anyway we can't see any difference between 300 fps and 400 fps but we can say power thermal and at an extent thermal throttle with the setting more power consumption means more electricity bill and more temperature can may lead to dry your thermal paste quicker uh, than those with less temperature also if you are using a stock cooler you can save a bunch of money not buying a new cooler or AIO let me show you the settings go to power options change plant setting then click on change advanced power setting scroll down process power management and in max processor state then the value to 99 and minimum processor state to zero that's all we need to do this setting can also reduce thermal throttle of hitty gameplay if you have any doubt comment down below i will see you in the next one